Pandora's box, according to ancient myth, was a gift from the gods, a wedding present from a devious use, delivered with the warning that it should never be opened. Of course, Pandora's curiosity proved too strong, and she peeked inside, instantly releasing all the misfortunes of mankind into the world. That was the myth. The truth, unfortunately, was far worse. The real Pandora's box was a device of incredible power. Ancient empires waged countless wars to possess it. Ultimately, a secret society called the Council of 98 hid the artifact from the world. For centuries, the artifact remained hidden, its location lost even to the succeeding generations of the Council. In the early 21st century, treasure hunters recovered a strange relic from the ocean floor. Unable to identify its origin, they brought it to New York City for study. Although hardly a front-page story, it caught the attention of my then-employer, Le Fay. His obsession with ancient history, with the origins of Pandora's box in particular, led him to recognize the true nature of the artifact. Le Fay initiated a plan for our organization, the Black Order, to recover Pandora's box before the Council could react, hiring an intermediary that wasn't under their surveillance. Charles Deckard was a thief, a career criminal who sold his expertise to the highest bidder. His mercenary heart made him an unwitting pawn in Le Fay's ultimate plan, a plan that did not become clear to me until I escorted Deckard to the museum holding Pandora's box, and he set in motion the events that would change the world forever.